Once we remove shine and prepare the natural nail with protein bond to prevent the product from chipping, we are ready for the base application. Now I'm going to show you guys what we do to make this really, really easy. We're going to take our base shell, I'm going to apply a strip down the center. I usually do this to all five fingers. And then what I do is I come back, get the excess off my brush, and gently brush the excess through the natural nail to make it as even as I can from side to side. Again, we don't need a lot. We just want to make sure that we put a really, really thin amount on the natural nail. Once we've done that, it's going to go inside the light for a minimum of two minutes. But here is the great thing. I will be working on the other hand doing the same procedure, applying base to all five fingers. Once I am done doing that, I'm going to switch hands. It'll usually take you about a minute to do, but remember, it's not about the timing, it's about rotating in and out of the light. Apply base to one hand, go inside the light, work on the other. Once you're done applying it to the other hand, immediately rotate hands and begin the brushing process. Once the base layer has cured inside the light for at least a minimum of one minute, the hand is going to come out and you want to take your dry gel brush and smooth out the sticky layer of the base. You're not removing it. All you're doing is making it smooth. This is going to guarantee a much better application when it comes to color. Once we've smoothed out the base, we're ready for our watercolor application. I am going to take multiple layers of color and stripe nice and gentle from the cuticle, the beige 102, blue 104, yellow 101, Melon 101, Green 104, and notice when I'm actually applying it, I'm almost floating the gel around the edges. Pink 106, and then right back on the tip with yellow 101. Once I have our striped layers, I'm going to take a striper brush and I'm going to pull from cuticle to free edge creating my water colored effect. Once we created our watercolor effect, this is going to go inside the light for a minimum of one minute while you're applying the other hand. Remember, do the same thing to the other hand. Once you're done, rotate. 